In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best ways on how to get stretch resolution in Fortnite. Let's get into it. All right, so the first way is going to be for NVIDIA users only. So if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, you just have to pull up your control panel by going right here. Right click and NVIDIA control panel. What you want to do is you want to go to change resolution and you will go to customize and create custom resolution it might say something and you just have to click accept and okay and what you want to do is just choose your resolution right here i have the best resolutions for fortnite down in the description so if you want to see them just take a look at them and then all you're going to do is make sure the refresh rate is the one you have on your monitor of course and you'll press test i already have it on but it should work make your screen black really quick and then it'll come right back and it should be stretched but one thing that people do make a mistake of is all right so the setting that i'm talking about is the window mode a lot of people will have it full screen do not have it like that because it will just naturally put it at one of these resolutions and most people will have it at 1920 by 1080 and it will not make it stretch resolution what you want to do is put it at windowed full screen because it will put it at the resolution of your monitor so if i have it on a different monitor that has a different resolution it will have it on that resolution always make sure you have that setting on like this all right so the next way to have stretch res on fortnite is by going into the files so what you're going to do this is press windows r and you'll see this pops up and since that was the last thing i had done on my other video it shows right here you're going to type percent local app data percent slash fortnite game i'm going to put it up on the screen and i'm going to have it in the description so you can copy and paste it all you're going to do is press ok and it'll take you to the files you'll go to saved config Windows client. So you'll see game user settings. You're gonna go right click, properties, then take off read only, press apply, apply, and then press right click on it again, open with and notepad. Now what you're gonna do is you're going to scroll down and you're gonna keep scrolling down until you see your resolution, which should be 1920 by 1080. You can see 1720 by 1080. All you gotta do is change it. So, like, if I wanted 1920 1080, I can do that. I can do 800 by 600, whatever. What you wanna do is, after you're done with that, you go to File, and then make sure you press Save. So it stays. You exit out, you go back, right click, Properties, Read Only, turn it, check that back, and then Apply. And then you're just gonna start up your game, and it should be good. All right, and the last way that we're gonna be doing is using Alpha Res. So if you just search up alpha res just like this, I'll leave a link down in the comments for the alpha res so you can just instantly download it. But you'll go on it, download, and right here download. And once it's done downloading, you have this. What you're gonna do is put whatever resolution you want, like say you want 1720 by 1080, you know the most popular one. And again, I will leave the um, description so if you wanna just copy and paste them in. You can have a full screen with a full screen. This really doesn't matter as well. You can uh, choose how much FPS you want to cap it at. You can do one FPS, two, whatever you want. Don't recommend doing anything under 30, obviously. You might break your game. So you do that, you press apply, and then that's all. This is probably the easiest way to do it and the best way. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like and stuff for more. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.